Thank you. The summer heat certainly not enough to keep comic book fans away. We are giving you a live look right now outside the Phoenix Comic Fest. It is packed there already. It's filling up. It That's kicks right. off today. 200,000 people are expected to turn out for this event throughout the entire week. And this event brings together some very creative people, too. And Team 12's Monica Garcia found a woman who's using her creativity to inspire. Monica. From cosplay to superpowers, a Gilbert woman is showing us that she can see what it takes to make it in the comic book world. When Marika Davis sits down to draw, nothing else matters. Today, she's got an audience, which her mother and this little gal. With a goal to create. I, I do pretty much just about everything. I, uh, I, I draw and uh, I, I write the, uh, the comic script. One of the greatest uh, things about comics is that you can sure. explore different perspectives. Different, the cornerstone of her comics. Sorry, I can barely see you. <laughs> At 24, this oh, one, Marika is already setting fires in the world of visual arts. This is uh, my left eye. Remarkable for a girl who struggles to see. The black is what I don't see. It's like having. Half. A brain tumor when she was just 10. I don't notice it that much until I run into something anymore. Followed by three brain surgeries has left her partially blind. Seems to be working for her. You know, you'll never succeed as an artist. You're visually impaired. And I actually did a comic on that too. With every sketch, Marika emphasizes her reality walking down a busy sidewalk with her cage. Just a normal person. Uh, I've got my cute little pink hat on, and this is the stereotype, this homeless person who's got a dog with him and, uh, and uh, is just begging for change. The series is called Life is Blurry, created for the Foundation for Blind Children. A lot of people think that uh, when you're blind, you are totally blind. Much of her work is translated into Braille and then audio versions. You've got people who've got tunnel vision, people who have right side hemianopsia like me, people who have left side hemianopsia. Cookie. Mm -hmm. Well, when you're an artist, you know, they say that the best, um, it's best to write from experience. An artist with a vision as colorful as her art. And for everything you need to know about Comic Fest, all you have to do is go to our website. That's 12news.com. From Phoenix, I'm Monica Garcia, 12 News.